I don't think I beat Enslaved, guys. Penta? Oh, it's <laughs> Penta trolling. Something like that. I don't think I win this one, no matter what I do. I'll still go for it, but I, I think they're just going to disrupt combo and win the game. Played, I have redeemed myself for Play Defender in the Colgrim deck. I don't know if you remember that. Were you the one who asked why do you play Defender in the Colgrim deck? Was that you? There's been some silly things involving Colgrim in during my time playing Gwent. Reckless Fairy, Casino L for Dea. Uh, that might have been. It's been a long time since I've had a video, but maybe somebody kept it. But yes, there is a. I happen to play my Casino Lippy list of Super Dea with Reckless Flurry. That's hot. Uh, You're like Satan. But that is hot. I do so dreadfully miss my darling little sis. Okay, we're doing great. We're doing great. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're going for it. No. Good as dead. Get your filthy hands. Yes. Uh, we'll still, I think, defend front row here. I would like you. I would like you. I would like you. And save me some time. Welcome to the team. I can't do it again. Because then Witch's Sabbath is going to brick. Alright, look. Here's my thoughts. I think we should 2-0 them. Because they haven't established anything. They haven't done any deck thinning. Their hand's going to be bad. And we should get 2-3. to three Straight up. 2-3 to three extra cards if we do this right. So I'm going to go for the 2-0 here. Um. Yeah, you seem you seem sus. We got the Yaga. I'm absolutely going for it. Um, this one's super easy. How many units do you have in your grave? You have plenty. Excellent. So we're gonna go ahead and get go into the deck. Get the Witch's Sabbath. We'll play it on front row. Go. I have no idea. We don't have a buy-in hand, which is a drag, but that's all right. Can't have a perfect hand every time. We have a day instead. Yes, yeah, a good push of Greg. We're already having enough trouble, Greg, though. I don't know if I want decoy on top. You can have whatever you want. My deck is literally the hottest of garbage. Here you go. Bridge troll. Good luck. What's the meme? It's this Monte Cristo. This is the meme. We have four cave trolls and two Siri dashes. Go. That's the meme. We got five. We got six. I need to. Wait. I need to wait for a four right now. We'll take our time though. Yeah, Monte Cristo. How does this mean? Yeah. Welcome. Welcome. Am I delivering unto you the impossible? I will leave room for the Yaga. Yeah, my word. This is cool. This is a cool meme. Thank you, Libita. Hey. Uh, no, it's Vladek. That's it. That's it. Vladek, it's good to see you here. How's it going? How's it going? Wanted to make sure I said it right because you pronounced, uh, told me it properly before. Uh, maybe I'll keep the Eternity Joust. Go like that. Because I just can kill half the Elch. They don't have a four. I can't eat anything yet, which is my problem currently. We got our double draw. So now we're on six on six with a 40 point lead. And we went minus one into this round. That's fine. You can lock whatever you want. I'm having a great time. Let's get the Larva out. I need a four. I just need like a Fire Scorpion, man. Oh, I can eat my own four. Duh, duh. Triton Wong. I forgot about that. Yeah, what am I doing? 
Yes, you're right. I should eat my own four. We'll go like this to... And then I forgot. We could just eat that. You're right. Which then enables me to eat the five and the six. Right. You know, life's hard. And sometimes you're not smart. Sure, you can take that. That's fine. Um, at this point, might as well kill it. They were pretty comfortable with that seize. I think they'll get it. Three more proxy, or at least two. And we are in med haze. We got the. We do have uh, a lot of good stuff coming. We have an eat in the back. Oh, they have a Redea. They're a Redea list as well. Unfortunately, I'm not sure they're quite as cool as us, which is always a hard thing, you know? Life isn't easy. Sometimes you're cool, and sometimes you're not quite cool and not. Feels bad, man, you know? I feel for them. I feel for them on an emotional level here. Ah, oh, man. It's a good life, guys. Yaga. We have two Siri dashes. We have four cave trolls. We have surpassed. What's the next nom? It's a seven up front. I'm waiting for it. Um, I think we want to go ahead and I think just go ahead and kill off the five here. Oh, that was wrong. It was kill Rodea because we have the uh, spores here. What do you want to make? Now, it would be very funny if you made a Yaga. Obviously, it wouldn't be a very good choice, but I respect it. An absolute slaughter. Was this fair? No. This was this was cruel beyond belief. Was it inhumane? You better believe it. We'll eat that. We reset there. I eat here. For the solid win. All right, we have found the way. We have found the way. It is Yaga. Good game. Yaga, I trust, I suppose. Okay, how does Yaga work? Sabbath. Oh, Sabbath is a seal. That's what it does. Okay. So, how do I win this? If I go for Cyana, she dies a cruel, sad fate. Unless, unless. Hold on. Hold on! My 100 IQ. No, I don't want to do that line. Hmm. I could also eat Yago if the with it. I could bait the removal. And if I only put like three units in my grave. What are you going to do here? This will tell me a lot about how this round is going to go. How bad is this going to be? Yeah, the moving of Defender is currently the big problem here. The other thing that tempts me is just eat, right? Just like, um, can I just eat the Defender? Like, if I just say Enter or Siri Dash, I think I'm totally, totally done for. I think I go for Cyana. I shall take back what is mine. You move it, you kill it. I know how this works. Let's hear the whistle. Or whatever it is. Goodbye. Sweet princess. It's been a pleasure. Do you have any idea what the monster buffs will be? No, but it should be by faction mostly. So maybe there'll be Death Wish buffs. I would eat Cyana and Siri uh, and the Cave Troll as the answer. Alright, Queen comes out. They heat wave this all forfeit. Hmm. Let us see. Hmm. All right, so we have an Arrakis Queen. Our goal here is in the pocket like 40 times so we can get this to work, but I guess it's not really that interesting. Should I just forfeit? Yeah, we'll try another. Uh, well, I have Yaga. So we could become secretly 
four cave trolls and a Yaga, but I will say it's still a really tough match, you know? Right, let's go ahead and doom that. And the late battle, hello. Oh, Girdo, how are you, my friend? How are you doing? Good to see you here. Welcome back, welcome back. Hmm. I like the Arrakis screen. I've noticed most of my decks are getting premium. I got a little bit more to go. Nice. That's fine. I think we just play nice and slow here. I think one of your struggles with the deck is uh, dash isn't worth the setup. That's true, but maybe it'll be now. The Yaga. Dude, is, I don't know if they're running. Um, oh yeah, they do have Madoc in hand. Yeah, never mind. They see a D bomb. You're right. They do have my. <laughs> they do have it in hand. That's awesome. I mean, honestly. Go. You're out, my friend. How's it going? How's it going? What if Dash is Snowdrop? Eh, I don't get much value. This has potential. Maybe I just had the wrong target with Dash. But Dash is so good of Cave Troll, right? Which I need for the setup anyways for Cyana. Why not Rodea copy Cave Troll consume Arrakis? Um, I don't actually want to play out the round fully. I think we want to pass here. But I want to force something out of them here. Multiple snowdrops going along. Ton of value. Oh, I see what you're saying here, Nate Dog. Ha! Oh, they are gonna regret this. All right, that was that was. I am literally the smartest player that's ever existed. We have Cave Troll and Arrakis Queen surviving, and second Cave Troll. We are going for the magical, unlimited Cave Trolls. Our goal is to get five Cave Trolls. I think is what I'm looking at right now. Five cave trolls, one Yaga. Gonna be good, gonna be good. Well, thanks, Harry. You're winning, I'm winning indeed. This is the easiest win of our lives. We are gonna pull this off. I think overwhelming hunger's flexibility to rack a screen is noteworthy. D bomb's great here. Got two units. Uh oh, I need to I need to kill one of their units before I witches. Give me a pass. They probably should pass because honestly, there it is. I mean, we'll take it. All right, hold on, hold on. Let's uh, let's try to win. It's one of our better shots at actually getting a win with this deck. Okay, right, I'm taking a picture. Got I got I got that high tech picture picture. Blurry, but it doesn't really matter now, does it? So I need to kill something of theirs. I need something in their grave. Because they, they're short a unit. I need to kill one more unit of theirs. Because I doom the Cat Witcher. We'll take our time here. Okay, what do I want? Red Haze and Drowner. I think Red Haze probably will get good value here. So I think I kind of want the Haze. Which means Bruxa goes. Or you go. Probably Bruxa. Eh. Drowner actually might be worth it. Alright, we play the Rodea. I can't Sabbath. Right now, Sabbath is just these two. I need them to, like, bomb it, kill it, anything to it. No drop Iteran combo. Ooh, T Waddle D. I'm liking where your thoughts are at right now. We're gonna run out of time on the stream at this rate, but maybe I'll do that tomorrow. Maybe we'll pick them up with this deck and try. No drop Iteran. That sounds hot. Iteran, Snowdrop, Arrakis Queen, Cyana. That seems super dumb. How many Snowdrops do we get? Let's uh, let's go get five Snowdrops. Okay, this is perfect. We just need to kill one of their units and then we're in business. Maybe Simulus just dies here. At two centuries, you behave like you were barely one. I'm loving the Elven Scribe. Elven Scribe is clutch. 
Whisper needs to dive, and then we're just gonna resurrect it in about two seconds anyway. So it doesn't like overly matter here. Guys, we are entering business territory. Hmm. Back row, perfect. Because I want to play with back row. Now I can give them... We have three on back. Ooh. Do I just play back row? I might just play back row. Well, maybe I should play front row. If they have Gezra, so I'm going to eat it. I think front row is right. Because they're, they're looking like orbs. No, they're not. I don't know what they're doing. We're going to play front row. If they have Gezra, so it'll, it'll, it's going to hurt a lot. Because I, I don't want this on back row. What about front, front row? Ah, eh, whatever. We'll give it front row. Three cave trolls. We're going for the five cave troll, guys. We're going for the five troll. So it's a Baya, E, Siri. No, so you don't have enough time. No, four. So she has a three, two, one, zero draws. We're good. Honestly, no, wait a minute. Let's just, let's just play the series, guys. And save me some time. But I don't need, I don't want to consume yet. I want the... I need I need this stuff to grow, right? You want to... I don't think I have to rush it here. I think we're going to eat this in a sec, though, actually. Seven, seven seems pretty good. You're a five... I'm at six right now, and it's kind of ticking me off. I don't have to rush it, though. So, Zero comes down. Do I have to Yaga? This is the question right now in my mind. So, eat, skip, eat, skip, eat. Yeah, Yaga should be max play. I should, I should eat the Matron here. Oh, but then again, I have this. I have one more turn. I have one more turn. I'm glad it's been buffed up right now. You're fine. You're a diamond dozen. Are you fucking kidding me? Catnip instead of crowns? They do get you get an additional turn, so we can take our time here. Uh, have you seen a fuse lying about, have you? Oh! Guys, I went too far! I have forgot about the spawn from this! Oh god, we have five K trolls protecting Siri, but nothing to protect the Yaga! Uh excuse me, Afana, could you move one of your guys back? You know when you reach for the stars? A bias should have been back, bro. You already thrive too. I need you to click the pyrotech. Oh! It's all part of my master plan, baby! Let's go! All part of my master plan. Unbelievable. How does he keep getting away with it? Jeez, man. I just like. It's hard to explain how someone can have this level of an IQ. So. Let's start by eating you. Yaga and five cave trolls. Show me what you've got. As you come on, maybe <laughs> the wood. All part of my master plan. I'm, I'm just saying. Literally smartest person on the planet. Have you seen this IQ? Have you seen this IQ? I uh, don't want to give me a six pointer. Okay, fine. This is Elven Land Dwarf, upon which your kind dies. I mean, you're gonna die a cruel side death if I do what I want to do here. But it's been fun. I think we want to just go ahead and put the Duncan to the back row. Saves us a point or two later. We get the draw on the bridge stroll. Yaga eats next turn, and I'm looking like a 10-point Cat Witcher for a 20-point swing. All right, guys, Yaga is genius. Yaga, Yaga is great. Yaga is the way. Yaga is the way. This is this is perfect. Hengave Sword for the Drowner. I love this. I don't know why you're running Hengave Sword, but I'm proud of you. Let's compose. Good to see you. Good to see you. Yep, Yaga is the way. I don't know what to say. Four more to go. I think I think it's time for us to. Eat up a little bit here. I'm just gonna take this off your hands, bud. Thank you. We'll go ahead and uh, play out the. Uh, we got the ice troll ticking. We got spores for the young dryad for nine. Beautiful guys. This is so good. We've done it. Yaga Arrakis Queen Cave Troll uh, with Cyana. Oh my gosh, this is hot. Yaga is solo carrying the game currently. This is the way. This is the way. 
We have found our way. Found the Yaga <laughs> cave drill. Um, they have no sixes. I wish I could kill that, but I can't. I mean, maybe I should use the red haze here. Just the murder here. Wow, because it's the best target. I mean, at four, but it doesn't seem very good. I think I'm supposed to murder here. They have no six, unfortunately. I, hey, you know what? You know what? I, I'm a genius. I uh, found the better spores target. Can't do it, but unfortunately, my friend, it is spores at the end. Yaga, our sec. What is it? Septa, sexta, cave troll. We're good. Quinta, Quinta, cave troll. Good game. Let's get bows. Uh, the answer is you lose. <laughs> I don't know what else I'm gonna tell you, but you just get your butt kicked. Like, what else is? What else happens? Um, don't need you. Yaga's great. Uh, I think Red is probably the weaker card here. Well, maybe D bomb. How do we do? This hand is legit garbage. Okay. Fine. We'll go to round two. Well, I don't, yeah, I have Arrakis Queen. I could just eat the Cave Troll and just trust that Yaga can carry this one. This better make it the. Of course, it make it the YouTube. I only, I only. <laughs> when, when part of every deck deck I play in this game is because I intend to make it go to YouTube. I think it's Cyana. Oh wait, do I have combo in hand? Actually, hold on. Why am I lamenting? I just have combo. Never mind, we're going for combo immediately. Do I just want a larva first? No, I think I think you're ah. Uh, I guess we're just going for combo. I mean, we we have more than two defenders on board. The game is hard. I know, right? Libida, you have four defenders on board and a Yaga behind it. It's actually just obnoxious. We have to be a little careful here. Like, Drowner might be an important card in this match. Feels weird to say. But, like, this is actually a problem because it kills Yaga. Because for some reason, they give one armor to Yaga. But it will kill my Yaga. Which is fine. We're going to go for the Siri dash and make it miserable for a second. This hurts me to see Onslaught used for sweaty meta decks instead of pure fire decks. Sorry, Monte Cristo. They have transcended. All right, so series down. Don't play ship brains. <laughs> should play onslaught. Coming down with the hot take. Oh man, it's so funny. What a silly deck. Yeah, well, we're not, I'm not yogging this anytime soon right now. Hmm. I mean, there's a couple lines here, and I haven't figured out which one I like the most. I mean, I think eating this is more important. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do. I'm making a judgment call here. All right, what do you got? My opponent's having a existential moment right now. A moment of, huh, that, that seems dangerous, doesn't it? Hmm, how far will you go? Will you kill Siri? It doesn't, I feel like you don't have getting slash. Unless you're thinking, Terror of the Seas is your solution? I would have buffed him, well, it's fine. Terror's perfectly okay, no problem. All right, so, let's think about this. Here's my plan, guys, ready? You guys ready for this? Um, Rodea's in deck, right? I need, I need, okay, okay, okay. We're gonna do this properly now. You first. Nah, okay, you have to, you can't do Cyana first or else it, it bricks Cyana for God only knows what reason. Yeah, so hold on, don't worry. I, I got like a six dimensional IQ play coming up. Don't you worry, it's gonna be great. Do I have any like good offensive? I got Bruxa, okay. Interesting. So what happens if I eat this? What is in it right now? It's Cyana and a Cave Troll. It's 10 plus 3, 17 if I eat it. 
Sure. I, I think I just eat it. I so miss my darling little sis. Honestly, this is better. Are you guys ready? Don't worry, guys. IQ. What is my IQ? 800 million. So don't you worry about it, guys. I'm all in control here. Ah, it's a meme deck. Your life becomes blurry. All right. Probably want A4. We found that to be useful in the past. I don't think we'll actually have a problem finding stuff to use against them. Beautiful. Let's get a nice long round. I mean, I could try to go for 2-0, but I don't have card advantage here, so I think we just pass. Their move. They're going to give the sunset here. I don't think but is boat coming out here. It's terror. It's terror. Light long ship and Brenna. So we actually use your front row here. So it's two cave trolls and an Arrakis queen. Guys, relax. Who's in charge? Me. Who's the best pilot in the meme deck world? Me. Literally. Literal god here. Um, do I have a near mint? Okay. Hmm. Nice. Relax, relax. Guys, I need you to not worry about me. Everything is fine. So. Kind of. That actually is a throw a big wrench in it. I wonder if I go like this, actually. Well, we do sab of melee. It's a four it's a five, a five, and a six, guys. It's two six actually and a five, pardon me. Uh so we are gonna be sabbathing melee, to be honest. And it's actually pretty good for us because it helps clog up this row. So Craig on Craig can't actually do everything he wants to be doing here. Ta -da. Okay. Now what? If they if they actually play Covenant, I'm gonna cry here. I need to start getting out stuff, though. I need to actually play units, unfortunately. I think they're have no problems killing behind here, so we'll play front row for the moment. Beautiful. Now we have a 50-50. Feeling lucky? We have our first. How far will you go, okay? I'm gonna look at the deck. Maybe you back row is better. Well, then you can onslaught it now. Front row is definitely right. Now you only have a 50-50 no matter what you do, because you can't ping through my three cave trolls. Sure. So you live. Hmm. I might have been too successful here, guys. I'm kind of sad at the moment. The goal was get two Radea procs here and make them both on the front row. But I think we've been too successful, right? Because, like, what I wanted to do was this. And I still think I'm going to do it. Because it's really funny. Oh, I could have done that. That makes sense for us. But the problem is, like, we only had a 50-50 there. If they play a, something on Craig, we're going to hurt here. Rather, I think this is way funnier. Hmm. All right, I have Sabbath, obviously. Damn it. Is it time for Yaga? Eat four, eat five. Six is there. I don't think I'm going to get a six, but I bet I can get a really good eat four if I play it right now. So, play the Yaga. Eat the eight on the back row. 
Your turn. I mean, this is I'm back is better, but it, this is way more fun. Maybe it's better. I don't know. We're we're doing fine right now. Are you a six? Oh yeah, we're really good actually. I can't believe you'll win this game. Maybe. I mean, this is a such a frustrating board. I'd be really sad if I were them. We have a three to tank, by the way, the Craig, which is key. And um, so uh, we're looking pretty good. Bukasa, bringing it back. Yum. Wheel harpooner. Uh oh. Hmm. How does this work? Let's find out, shall we? If I abandon you and click here, what happens? Oh, I just get one more. Sweet. All right. Hmm. Oh, actually, do I have the biggest unit out there? No, so you're kind of useless. We'll just play you. All right, go. Everything's fine. Don't you worry, guys. Everything is fine. Like, what are you going to do? This procs next turn. Me... Something. My opponent's like, please! Oh? They made it through two of them, guys. Look at this progress they're making. Jesus, man. They got one of these... Lassie. I do so dreadfully miss my darling. Uh, I need a five. Do I have a five in my deck? Oh, I don't. Okay, is there a five in front row? Nope. Okay. Well. You mean this four provision boat here, guys? This one is the five provision boat. They're both in the grave. Sorry to say, guys. Right, what kind of orders do I have here? Uh, best I got, I think, is Bruxa. Or Drowner. Drowner's pretty funny. Get me a drowner. I need the rain to hit the Cyana so I can get more value out of Arrakis Queen. Oh, you, you get me more, Clark. Need a little bit of luck. I need I need the cyanide to die. Oh, this one's purified. And wait, how did they got purify? Wait, am I a fool? Did I miss something really obvious, guys? Why was that purified? Close. And it couldn't just didn't have another Yaga target at five. If I could eat four, this would be an easy win. G G. With Philippa status ball deck. That way, call it. Yeah, that, see that matchup's really good because Philippa, it's it's literally a lockdown deck. With a ton of awesome stuff. Mad deck number three, indeed. Welcome to the game. Uh, ooh, you didn't do anything fancy. Uh, I don't want to open this one up then. Well, seems like a good squirrel target. But yeah, it's like, that that works. And there's a reason why Nilfgaard constantly performs in all metas. is because it can always interact with decks that require interaction. As opposed to like everything else, which has leader abilities, but most of them don't interact. Alright. Oh yeah, by the way, meme tournament. No, uh, yes, there's a meme tournament coming up. It's been rescheduled, and I forgot to mention that. Meme tournament is being rescheduled. I hope I have updated it. I might not have updated it. Let me give everyone the link to it really quick. 
It was supposed to be... It's already been rescheduled. It's on March 19th now. March 19th is, in fact, the meme tournament. So, I almost think we should get the... I think we should do this. Okay, so we're gonna go Cyana. I'm gonna play you. I'm gonna eat the Cave Troll. I'm gonna eat the Siri Dash. Fantastic. Congratulations, you beat me. Now, we're gonna find the way to make this work. Do we have... What's a meme tournament? It's a tournament that you're supposed to play fun decks and it has a massive ban list. I mean, a gigantic um, ban list. It's huge, it's long, and the goal is to get rid of every single interesting or uninteresting deck from the game. Which is not easy, for the record, but we did our best. No guarantees every deck you hate is out, but we put up a good fight. We put up a good fight, as one might say. We need to get mulliganing. I do need something like um, a Neuromancy. Is there anything I can get valuable? Is there any... Oh, I can get Maxi out. Alright, congratulations. Top looks great. Okay, we got a really nasty board coming, guys. And we only have two monster units in there, but it's fine. We're literally going to give him Coral, which kind of hurts, but alright. Destroying earlier of Rat Clog, it's so good. I love Rat Clog Overlord, it's so good. Alumni is bad because if you lose round one, you lose round three, which is not fun. I gotta confess. Alumni is bad design because it basically says your deck must have four removal spells or you just lose round one. It's hyper consistent, it's so nasty and dangerous and frustrating, and I hate everything about it. Now, mind you, I'm a memer. Like, in terms of interaction, it encourages it, if anyways. Because it basically says, hey, you lose the game if you can't interact enough. Am I going to be short when my gold's like, yeah, I, didn't, I forgot it was bringing back you. Um, what's my things I don't want here? Maybe I don't want a lot of ton hounds. And then the next one, I think, is Maka Mail, So I'm going to just leave it, to be blunt. Hmm. This actually is going to work. I don't know if we'll win, but I'm proud of it going off, so we take it. If they play Xavier, I'm going to cry. Let's see. Uh, can we cheese our win here? Is the cl is that clog the in the master list of decks? I'm sure it is. I'm 100% sure I've shoved it somewhere in there. So, Jean Leasy, here's your deck list. And remind me, don't let me forget that I need to talk to you about Jordan Peterson. And try to help you unravel the man that is Jordan Peterson. Stand before the Queen of Skellige. The likes of it's fine. We're not really in a rush here. We can take our time. Perfect. I mean, do I just do these four in front and then play for back row? There's not really a row lock here. There's no row lock here. We're only getting these two out, by the way. That evil dude, that evil dude. Indeed, great sir. He's very good at convincing people that he's not crazy. He's a crazy one, guys. Very convinced a lot of people without them knowing. Because he tells them, licks in their ear, very kind, generous sounding things. Like, oh, you should love everyone. Except these particular people who are scientifically proven in one obscure study to be study to be evil. What are you doing? Is Dwim really your best next play? Yeah. 
I mean, do I play slow? Like, I just need... I mean, I'm sure I'm going to screw this up, I'm sure. How many cards do I need? One, two, three, four, five. No, no way I can't not get the draws I need. Um, ESP, Warwoody, welcome to the Plain Talk family. Thank you so much for the follow there. Welcome aboard. Check out the socials. First one's gaming. Second one is news. And I hope you're having a great day. Welcome aboard. The TC was great. The, the, I'm, I, it's right for them to remove it. I'm not going to deny, but boy, did we we unleash some serious carnage with that meme deck as a community. Finally up on time to catch your stream. Glad, Thought the Beans. How's it going? How's it going? I don't know what they're waiting for, I'll be honest. Sure. Are you guys ready? Yeah, we're going to do a backward just to be safe. You guys ready for this? Are you guys ready for this? Let me show you my real power. Do we have to give him a lot of units here? Meme Scoria Teldex. It's been a while. Not, not super over the top. Oh, yeah, you killed the ritual. Uh, now we go like this. And now we go like this. And it's beautiful. It's so good. All right, this idea worked out well. Thank you to the person on YouTube who said I should be experimenting with Cyan and Arrakis Queen. You were right. All right, we're good. <laughs> Thank you so much, that person. They are correct. All right, we got two Siri Dashes and three Cave Trolls. It's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's right. Lur take out all the lurkers are like, oh my gosh. Absolutely majestic. Little bit of Cyana. Little bit of Cyana. You get tossing it in there. Yeah, you get your um, Beautiful. Now, obviously, we still have to win from here, which is going to be an interesting battle. But we'll do our best. We'll do our best. Um, How do I even want to begin this? I think, I think Hideous Feast is a pretty good choice here. Um, what do I want to do here? Is there anyone even worth killing? Not really. Now make sure that lives. Ah oh, man. That is majestic. My opponent's like, why? What? And I'm like, yep. Man is an arrogant creature. They have to decide. I would mush it here and just try to protect it. But I wonder if they have Getty in hand, so they're hesitating. I'm going to murder that Crow Clan if they pass here. Aww. Um, Madrame. Okay, on what? Be buffing up. I mean, at this point, clearly, this is looking like the right thing. Well, you might still be the right reset. Like, I don't know if I have enough points to actually pull this one off. We're going to fight. We'll fight for our best. Fortunot has a funny way of biting you in the ass. I'm going to say that's a better one, but that's right. Can we pull this off? Ritual still going. Could it work with decoy? Well, yep, yeah, decoy would work. I mean, I could do some really wild stuff and try to get like six units on her or something insane. I don't know how exactly that would work, but we, I could find it. I could figure it out, I'm sure. All right, you come down. Go. I, mean, I think I think she knows it's going to be wrong here. I think we should cut her. For what is the real question, though? Hmm. Uh, ESP Warwoody. Watch all your new watch all your new YouTube videos. Started three months ago. Your work is great. Thank you, thank you much. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Those kind words. It's almost guaranteed to be heat wave at the end. I don't know if I have enough points here. Like I don't have tall removal in my hands. So what do I do here? This world ever free. Protecting you, buddy. I'm gonna purify you. Keep ticking, bud. I don't think I have the points at the end. Heat wave is kind of a drag. It's still eight points for them. Nah, not your uh, the other man. But I put up the best fight I got, and I'm proud of it. You know.
Man, they have so many freaking points. All right, I'm proud of our fight. I'll take the combo. We lost, but it's a spiritual win in my book. Good game. Let's do some work on the deck. Shoutouts to Ahmed Ali, McRandar, Sydney 81 and Wincent for all their generous and ongoing support on the Patreon. Thank you all so much.